In this video, we'll walk you through the new customization page in YouTube Studio. This page lets you change the homepage layout, branding, and basic info for your channel. Let's first dive into the Layout tab. This tab lets you select and organize what viewers see when visiting your channel. First, you can add a video spotlight. This is the main video someone sees when visiting your channel, and you can showcase a different video depending on if the viewer is subscribed or not. For people who aren't subscribed, you can add a channel trailer. A channel trailer can be a quick video that highlights what you create, what viewers can expect from your channel, and encourages people to subscribe. For returning subscribers, you can add any featured video. You can change or remove these videos at any time by clicking the three-dot menu. Next, you can add featured sections. Sections allow you to customize what viewers see when they land on your channel homepage. They're made up of videos and playlists. They help you organize and showcase content from your channel. To add a section, click Add Section. Choose if you want to feature videos, playlists, or channels. With videos, you can choose from a list that will pre-populate the videos for you. For example, uploads will automatically add any new video that you publicly upload to your channel. Popular uploads will automatically showcase your top 12 videos with the highest views. Playlists lets you highlight playlists already curated by you or other creators. Single playlist will display a carousel of videos you've added to that playlist, showing the most recently added video first. And multiple playlists will allow you to group multiple playlists under one section and allow you to add a section title. Finally, Channels lets you showcase your other channels, your collaborators, or any other favorite channels. Next up is the Branding tab. With this tab, you can add various branding elements that can help make your channel visually unique and let viewers know what they can expect if they subscribe to your channel. First, you can add a profile picture. Your profile picture will appear wherever your channel is represented on YouTube, like next to your videos, comments, and in user search results. Next, you can add a channel banner image. This appears across the top of your channel and can give viewers a visual sense of your channel and content. Make sure to follow the image size requirements to get the best results. Finally, if you add a video watermark, it will appear on your videos in the bottom right-hand corner of the video player, and viewers can use it to subscribe to your channel. You can choose when it shows during your videos, at the end, at a custom start time, or throughout the entire video. Finally, there's the Basic Info tab. This tab lets you edit your channel name, add a channel description, add translations for your channel name and description in other languages, add links to sites you want to share with your viewers, and add contact information in case you want people to email you with business inquiries. Once you make changes to any of these tabs, click Publish to make your changes live on your channel. For more info about how to use YouTube Studio, check out this playlist. Thanks for watching.